And without much more ado, let me introduce this panel, uh, which, uh, as Lena said, is a fantastic panel to discuss this. I just want to introduce Fatima Farag, first of all. Uh, Fatima ha runs an organization dedicated to media excellence um, and community media. She's an experienced journalist in the Middle East and uh, has worked for the Washington Post as well. And in particular, works to train uh, young journalists in the Middle East and in Egypt in particular. Uh, on my right, Michaela Rong, um, the author, I'm sure you know, of many acclaimed books on Africa. Um, and also, um, I hope you don't mind me calling you a veteran reporter of elections mm -hmm. <laughs> in, <laughs> in Africa. Um, has written uh, about elections in Kenya, has written a book on Eritrea, which as I was preparing for this event, I noticed was at the bottom of the League of Press Freedom in the entire world, uh, which is worth reflecting on. Uh, Dawid Azani, um, from Afghanistan, and uh, was the BBC World Service Bureau Chief in Afghanistan in 2010 to 2011. Uh, very lucky to have him here. Obviously, we're looking at the results of that major election over the next couple of weeks, so uh, Dawood will talk to us about that. And James Dean of the BBC uh, Media Action, um, a, an organisation associated with the BBC, but very much looking at how we can support media in the developing world and how we can support journalists who often find themselves in the firing line, especially at times um, of political pressure and around election time. So without much more ado, I'm going to hand over to Fatma, who's going to discuss to us a little bit about the situation in Egypt. <laughs> 